المساجد والمنازل رباه سلم أهلها واحمل مخارج والمدائن Disasters come unannounced and wipe off everyone and everything in their path. No matter how swift the country is in responding to them, there's a lot of damage already done. For the last few years, one third part of the earth is the victim of different calamities. This past year has been a year of great calamity. Floods, earthquakes, typhoons, drought, famine, and man-made disasters. The people affected by such catastrophes are not able to recover from the damage by exploiting their existing minimal resources. In such circumstances, the best ways to minimize the ill effects of such occurrences are to understand and implement disaster risk reduction techniques and to always be ready for any unfortunate happening. Helping Hand for Relief and Development has always been on the front line at the time of need after any natural calamity. For this purpose, it has its Emergency Response Program. It serves in case of natural calamity. The first priority is provision of relief to these people in terms of shelter, clean drinking water, food, and other basic needs including health facilities to the needy people on emergency basis. Uh, we are right now in Syria. Uh, we are providing assistance to people uh, here in Idlib uh, in different camps, uh, including the uh, Karama camp, uh, also Adma camp, and uh, Ayaba camp. Uh, and, uh, and we have uh, we are providing people with food and hygiene items. And as you can see, those items are over here, uh, properly boxed and uh, placed over here, so that you can understand what kind of items we are providing. Uh, this is the area, Lalitpur area, close to Kathmandu. Uh, today we have a uh, medical camp here in this area and uh, you see home, so many patients here uh, today uh, in our medical camp. Uh, this area is uh, badly affected uh, and you can see that we have uh, many families living in this area. Today is the 29th of October and helping in for relief and development is uh, continuously supporting to the earthquake affected people of uh, Khyber Pakhtunkhwa. Later on, it works towards the rehabilitation and re-establishment of the country through long-term projects. A unique method adopted by HHRD is the training of volunteers to take action in the best possible way immediately in case of a disaster. After the basic relief, Helping Hand helps the affected people get back on their feet by provision of interest-free loans under interest-free microfinance program. The people are helped to utilize these loans in different ways of income generation and then they easily pay back the original amount in small installments. Soon after, they're independent and earning decent livelihood and writing a better future for themselves and their families. This is a small effort towards HHRD's goal of saving maximum lives and aiding the people facing hardship which is achieved by the contributions of its generous donors. To be ready for any other challenge and to be there for the people through their hard times, we need your help. This Ramadan, donate generously for our brothers and sisters. Send in your sadaqats and zakat to us so that we can reach out to those in need. For details, visit our website www.hhrd.org or call at one triple eight eight oh eight four three five seven.